The upgrade of the nanotools facility will allow us to do, or remain competitive internationally, train a lot of new students and uh, highly qualified personnel in this field, uh, and remain competitively international on three levels with three platforms. The first one is in the field of nanoelectronics photonics, where we try and understand how light photons get converted into electricity in the field of organic photovoltaics, understanding the fundamental limitations of how well you can make a solar cell and how long it'll last. We need to understand the science, we need to train people in this field, and we need to be able to apply it. The second project in this, on this platform is um, using gallium nitride nanowires to create more energy efficient uh, illumination device light bulbs. It turns out that about 20% of electricity could be saved by having more efficient light bulbs. And Zetian Mi and his research group are well on the way of using nano, nano electronic devices, gallium nitride, to make better light bulbs essentially. So the second platform is about imparting properties to, onto mechan into mechanical materials. We want to understand fundamentally how biochemical signals transduct into mechanical motions of materials and then use these materials, for example, silicon carbide, to make more powerful sensing devices that could be used, for example, in, in cell phones. You know, you can breathe at them, that can measure how healthy you are, or even, for example, measure the quality of the environment in a city and crowdsource this and thus get a global picture of, of, in, of what is happening instantaneously at any point in the, in the city. So the third, third platform is in the field of nanobio. We're building chips, microfabricated chips, where we can study essentially the brain, uh, formation of synapse, formation of connection between neurons. The same technology, or the, this technology we need to develop to do this fundamental science can then be used to study drug interactions with the, the brain, important fields like uh, Alzheimer's or Parkinson's in the future.